started rising my two pounds of russet potatoes for my tricolor gnocchi. You really do need a ricer. The potatoes, uh, I bake them for an hour at 400 degrees, and then I let them cool for about 15, 20 minutes. You don't want to let them cool any longer than that because then they'll be really difficult to rice. I'm going to just a pinch of salt, a bit of black pepper, just a little. One egg. half a cup of ricotta. And my Prada, say hello to my Prada. Prada, say hi. Say hi. Oh, she's, my, she's my best friend. She's always near me. Now I'm going to add a cup and three quarters of all-purpose flour. Here's my gnocchi dough. I'm going to divide it into three. I'm going to eyeball it. Now one I'm just going to keep white, and this one I'm going to make red. And I'm going to use tomato paste to make it red. And I'm going to put, I don't know, a tablespoon and a half. We'll see how it looks. We can always add more. So here's my red ball of gnocchi. I ended up adding three tablespoons of tomato paste. To make this gnocchi green, I'm using spinach. I'm just putting it through a uh, processor. It was about two and a half cups of spinach. My green gnocchi is ready. So, green, white, and red. My Italian gnocchi is ready. So I started with the green. I rolled them out. Now I don't need these until Sunday for my parents for lunch and it's the big Euro game. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to roll out the gnocchi. I'm going to put them on this tray, cover them with two, three sheets of saran wrap to prevent them from drying and keep them in the refrigerator. Now I'm going to make mine about an inch apart about an inch. A gnocchi maker. If you don't, you can use a fork. You just push down and you turn. I bought this in Tuscany. If, if you're ever in your travels, go to stores, go make friends with the with the employees at the, at the hotel and go where they go shopping. And uh, you pick up all kinds of wonderful things. My green, white, and red Italian gnocchi are ready for Sunday for the Euro Cup. I think my parents are going to love it. Sunday, I wish Italy all the luck in the world. Forza Italia.